Hi, I'm Ben and I'm at the Makerspace in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. And today I'm going to build a bulletproof coffee table. <laughs> this project was inspired from finding a really cool piece of salvage. A couple of years back I was working construction and I was working remodeling an old bank branch into a dentist office. So my job one day was to take out the drive through So I literally had to take the bank drive through apart from the inside, including removing a piece of bulletproof glass. Well, I set it off to the side knowing it would make great material for a future project. So I'm going to start off by cutting up some pallet racking, welding it together, attaching some post legs to build the bulletproof coffee table. Okay, so here's my bulletproof glass, and then on the floor, I have uh, the main parts laid out. I cut four sections of the pallet racking uh, to the size that fits around the bulletproof glass, and those ends are going to go straight into some two-inch steel tube. That's uh, two inch across in both directions. It's a quarter inch thick, and I made it 18 inches high for sort of a coffee table height. Now, one thing that I got to watch out for here is that these pieces are not quite two inches across. They're actually, they're pretty close to three, which means about an inch of it, I need to have a bevel. So I'm going to have to cut this one like this and this one like this, because otherwise they can't go together. That middle bit um, is getting in the way. The other way I could do it is to cut a notch. Now, this is right side up right now, so these pieces will actually be up here, and this lip is what the bulletproof glass is going to sit on. So here now I've got the table tack welded together, so I've got the four legs and the frame. I kinda clamped it all to the glass to uh, get the tack welds done, and now that it's together, I'll do the welds properly, and then after that it'll be a matter of uh, cleaning up and painting. Thank you. 